first thing I say every morning, my spinning span, <laughs> my spinning fan, and it actually gets my, you know, my head rolling with ideas for my next artistic piece or maybe a piece I'm working on. And I usually wake up around, let's say, like nine ish, eight o'clock, eight o'clock really, but. I know it's not 9 yet and so I get back into bed and I get out at 9. Um, get out of my bed at 9 when I know it's 9. At 9 I'm like, you know, I have to get this day started. I usually like a good morning routine. I give myself a good facial massage. Over here I'm using rose sip seed oil and a little bit of argan oil. I also enjoy grape seed oil. And, um, you know, today specifically has been pretty gloomy so I really needed that facial massage to you know get that energy flowing and you know I had to run to the store and pick up some milk we did run out of milk milk is essential for this coffee I'm drinking coffee for sure I need um, I mean recently especially I'm, I was never a coffee or a tea drinker growing up but this coffee I really really needed um, today especially I, with this weather and you know yes yesterday and a couple days before that it was pretty warm and pretty sunny and and i was like where did that sun go Where's, where did that californian sun go please my mom is making some goodies and i'm ready to make my to-do list i love making that little list you know it, it gives me satisfaction to just know that i have something to look forward to for the day that i'm being productive just, you know, just want to make sure that life of a full-time artist is indeed productive and I'm moving towards a certain direction. So I am ready to paint. This is the piece that, you know, I currently working on. I usually go from piece to piece. I, I, I try not to work between two pieces. I know some artists do do that and, you know, it really depends on you know how comfortable you are doing it I usually you know finish one piece and go to the other but really yeah it depends um, you know it really it's it's not about me trying to plan that I was just how I've been doing things it's just my yeah my way of doing things so you know I have so for this I actually used a little bit of um, some acrylic pore paints that I did um, you know buy a couple months ago and I thought I should use uh, my base was just I used um, you know some gesso first I actually gessoed um, I gessoed a lot of this painting I did water down some of the gesso for some other uh, for, for the corners of the painting but yeah I did gesso it down first and then you know I applied like a goldish layer before the gesso completely dry I applied this gold layer of acrylic paint and it actually, you know, made this really interesting pastelish um, gold, which I really enjoyed. I actually had, you know, that was my art giveaway, you know, that was, um, um, uh, that was something I have to mail out for someone who won one of my art prints in my Instagram giveaways. So do follow me on Instagram, A-R-T-B-I-K-A. If you wanna, you know, win a painting ever, I do do these giveaways once every couple months. And yeah, so, you know, most of my day does go in, uh, a lot of my day does go in painting or thinking about, you know, um, what my next piece should be, or, you know, what kind of series I should come up with, What art shows I have you know already um, in the future for me so I have to think in terms of that and you know what pieces I would want in it you know how big how small how I want to arrange stuff um, you know just curate so you know when you want to think of a theme you want to think of well I don't I would say that you know all of my pieces are one theme essentially but just in terms of like color and you know what you want to go what you want to do in a sh an art show so this is actually I um, am making a poster for like my art students I am an art teacher as well so you know I I have a cow painting session coming up 
this weekend for my kids and my baby nephew i cannot wait for him to grow old enough to join one of my classes i think it would be very entertaining he you know he definitely has inspired me in many ways and you know more than he knows this past year as i've been quarantined with him for quite a bit so you know when i really think about what inspires my work it's really everything even though that's really really broad it's a broad it's 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 really broad but it's really <laughs> everything mm-hmm.